Hello everyone and welcome back to Mossley Farm and it is another beautiful snowy day outside and I just wanted to show you guys I have altered the house a little bit. I have added in some beautiful windows over here so we now have two windows looking over our kitchen where I am actually going to whip up if I could. Dang I'm one algae short. I was going to whip up some more algae soup but we are short on algae just a little bit. The miners treat still sounds so cool. Oh yeah that gives you the plus on ma mining and the magnetism. We're gonna have to look into that in the future and then what else do we have? Maki rolls. I need to get rice and seaweed. We might go buy some rice today so that we can make this maki roll because the maki roll and I think the fried egg are both items that are in one of our bundles. The chef's bundle that we can actually work on. I wonder if Gus, we'll take Gus a pretty awesome um, fried roll, like fried egg on his birthday. In fact, let's take him a fried egg today. Just to do that, we'll take a couple fried eggs over to him. And let's see, nothing that I can make. I need to get my hands on some more of the winter roots. But yes, yeah, so there's that. And I need to move some plants around because plants need to be absolutely everywhere in my opinion. So where do I put plant? Uh, put the plant right there. I still need to move the chest, but I need to make more chests before I can move my chest. I added another window over here. I moved one of the paintings in over here. I kind of want a different kind of bed. I'm going to be looking into maybe finding a different kind of bed of some kind and yeah so that is that I've already watered my winter crops let's go up and take care of all of our animals noodle doodles how are you meow indeed meow indeed all right and then let's come in how's everybody doing we've got some large eggs <gasps> we've got lots of large eggs today yay so my hen hens are very happy no new dinosaur egg but that's okay pea pod is still doing well and we actually have yay sweet peas doing well Woohoo! And then Zenya is doing well. My my chickens actually really love me. Marigold is doing fine. All right, let's go ahead and put these down for everybody in here so they have plenty of food. No new dino eggs, that's okay. We still have a dino egg I need to give to Gunther at the museum. And we have another one sitting inside the incubator. Apparently they sell for a lot of money too, so that would be really fun to get our paws on. Let's run up here. Let's see what's going on inside. No fruit today, that's just fine. We have a little bit of, a little bit, we have a lot of uh, different materials to put into our chest. We are getting so much stuff in the mines lately. It is fantastic. And we are gonna go deeper into the mines hopefully today. Um, I should probably leave that large egg. I'm just gonna leave that right here for now. I'm sure it'll be fine. And then I've also got some amethyst to give away as gifts. Um, an Omni Geode to go crack open. Apparently Clint actually enjoys these as presents too. But you know, it's an Omni Geode. It could be anything. I love surprises. I love random and I love surprises like that. And then let's come in and check on my cows. Hello, Bluebell. So Bluebell is doing well. Let's see about milking them really quickly. Do you have any milk? Yeah, there we go. And then Primrose is doing well and she's got milk too. Sweet. <gasps> she already has a large milk. Oh my gosh. She already has large milk. Okay. Don't panic. Nobody panic. That means we can go and put it in. We can put it in the bundle. And then we'd only be missing either wool or a large goat milk uh, or a duck egg. I can actually get ducks. Let's go buy a duck. We're going to go buy a duck now so that we can get a duck egg. And then we would just be missing either large goat's milk or wool. So we're going to go buy a duck egg. <laughs> we're going to go buy a duck. 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 Okay. Let's go. We're going to go buy a duck. And actually, I did want to run down and maybe cut down some more of the trees because we definitely need to get a larger. Um, whoops. <laughs> oh, look at that. So the oak resin is still or the um, maple syrup is still coming out, even though it's this time of year. And I need to leave my milk pail here. What am I doing? I am just dashing off. I'm so excited. Um, going to keep this for bundles. Oh, yeah. And then going to keep that for bundle. Going to take the milk. Going to put the maple syrup inside. Maybe with the milk. I'm keeping a lot of the milks because they're needed in so many recipes. So let's go buy a duck. That is going to have to be like the next thing we do. Where did my... Oh, there it is. That is going to be like one of the next things that we focus on. And then I need to get over to crack open that geode. There's just so much to do, you guys, even in winter. Every time I think things are going to get like a little bit easier, we're going to get a little bit more uh, done on the farm or more done inside of the mines. We end up doing all sorts of other stuff. There's Jazz and I have a crocus. Hey, Jazz. Miss Penny is teaching me how to write in cursive. She has such pretty handwriting. Miss Penny is pretty cool. 
All right, there you go, Jazz. I love presents, thank you. <laughs> Wonderful. And yesterday we actually had our very first 10 heart relationship with Linus. And that makes me really happy because we've tried to be good to Linus since the very beginning. And here's our duck. Oh my gosh, it's very expensive. It's gonna be worth it though. <sighs> Breathe deep, it's gonna be worth it. All right, and let's go ahead and put it in the coop and I'm going to name it Cattail. Because you always find ducks and cattails. Great! I'll send little cattail up to our new home right away. Yay! And hey, Marnie, how are you doing today? Hi, need something? Not too much. Um, I don't really have anything to give her as a gift right now. All the better reason to have some duck eggs. Maybe people will appreciate duck eggs as gifts. So who knows? All right, let's go ahead and just ride over to Gunther's. Um, that was the money I was going to use. Yes, more crocuses. That was the money that I was going to use to buy the super fancy fishing rod. But now I'm kind of getting this urge since we can do so much. Oh, I need to talk to Lewis about the, the slimes I slayed. Oh, Siri, so you helped us with our slime problem? Thank you. I hope you didn't get through too much trouble. I know it can be really hard to get those sticky slimes, that sticky slime out of your clothes. I definitely ruined a few good pairs of pants trying to catch those little squirmers. I can remember mama throwing a fit after I got uh, glimmer gold slime all over my brand new dress pants. Anyway, enjoy your reward. Awesome, what was my reward? And the saloon can get pretty lively at night. He likes to go over. Okay, what's my reward? Yay, a little bit of money. Not enough, just 500 short again for that fishing rod. I need to stop buying things. Oh, hey, there's Elliot. How you doing, Elliot? Breathe deep. Did you notice it? The smell of the sea. Elliot, that's down at the seashore? Whenever I smell the sea, it reminds me of my youth. The ocean really impressed me as a child. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, well, let's keep moving. I'm glad he's happy. He's going to draw inspiration, even though it's not going to be from us. Oh. So he's gonna get plenty of inspiration from the ocean. Let's come up to crack open our Omni Geode at Clint's. I guess I can give Clint like, I'm out of corn. Where'd my corn go? I think I sold my corn. Well, whoops. <laughs> hey Clint, let's go ahead and process this geode. And it's a fire, a uh, little fire quartz. So let's see if the fire quartz is worth anything. Um, Let's see, artifacts, minerals. Mm, worth like a hundred. Does he like it as a gift? I kind of need it. <laughs> but I, I really want to give... Um, We're just going to talk with him today. Business has been slow lately. You should upgrade your tools. I could use the cash. Maybe he likes quartz? Okay, I'm going to give it to him. Why not? Never mind. It saved me from having to give it to him because I've already given him two gifts for the week. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's kind of funny. All right, well, let's come on up. And we're gonna donate to the museum. All right, Gunther, I have a dinosaur egg. Believe it or not, laid by a fresh dinosaur. So, fresh laid. All right, and I'm so glad I saved my dinosaur egg to hatch first because I haven't found a second one. It's been almost a year. And our dinosaur, once hatched, can just continue laying eggs. Let's go down to the beach to see what's going on. Maybe I can find some corals and get really lucky <laughs> and be able to... Uh, yeah, maybe just stumble on the coral. No? Get super lucky. There's a nautilus shell. <gasps> and there's a cockle. Yes! Two nautilus shells, no less. Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh, and there's stuff over here! <gasps> maybe I will be able to buy the new... Oh, but do I want to... Mm. No, I'm going to get the new fishing rod. It's the last fishing rod. It'll be worth it. Oh my goodness, look at all this. So much! So much! And I have bug meat that I can bait these traps with now. Because we went down and we slayed some bugs. And I have more driftwood I can give to Leia now as a present. All right, let's go up and let's see what our good friend Willie thinks about all of these fish. I think I can sell them to him and then turn right around and buy the new fishing rod. So let's see if we can do this. All right, Willie, let's talk shop. All right, not the shell, not the shell, that, that, that. <gasps> And we can do it, you guys! We can do it! The Iridium Fishing Rod! I'm buying it. Okay, I've got to do this. Okay. <sighs> it's going to be worth it. All right. That was all my money. <laughs> We've been in this situation before. All right, my good friend Willie. There's rumors of some rare fish in these parts, but only an experienced angler could stand a chance against them. You need the finest bait you can get if you want a rare fish to bite. I think that one of the finest baits we could possibly get, and let's go ahead and load this puppy up. 
I want to head home so we can get one of the little bobbers too. That would be so cool. But one of the finest baits we can get is probably the one that Linus taught us how to make with wild bait, bug meat and slime. So one day when we are trying to catch rare fish, we'll have to try that out. All right. Ah, and I just remembered we do need to actually use the Iridium fishing rods. We do need to catch a squid. Willie does want a squid. Okay, okay, but that's the ocean and winter nights. Oh my gosh. All right, so we might have to come back here and try to catch a squid for Willie later. Oh my gosh. I can't believe we did it, you guys. We have the Iridium fishing rod. I'm really not sure what to do with it just now, except try to make tons of money. I can't believe we spent so much money. Look at all the stuff we just have clogging up our inventories. Oh my gosh. Well, let's hurry and get home. I think it's early enough in the day. And Jody, tonight, you guys, let's come by and let's have dinner with Jody and her family. And let's come over and say hello to Emily. Hey, Emily. It must be so cold for the poor fish. I wonder if the only if only if any fish hibernate. Maybe I should ask Demetrius. Emily, that's adorable. All right, and I think we can give her a flower, maybe. Thank you. I'm feeling a positive energy from this gift. That is awesome. And I haven't actually given Haley any gifts in a very long time. I feel kind of bad because I just sort of like tossed her aside without meaning to. I'm going to start writing a list of all the clothes I need for next spring. Um, crocus. Yes, for me? Thank you. <gasps> hey, those crocuses. That makes me so happy, actually. Oh, and can we get up to Robin's? Let's see if we can get up to Robin. I don't have anything. Mon I don't have money. Never mind. We well, I want to see if we can get up to Robin's, but I don't think there's a point because I have no money. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'll be baking cookies today. I like to make flower shapes in the spring. Maybe I'll tell you my recipe one of these days. Poor little Evelyn. I really need to try to be better friends with her. Let's give her a crocus too. I need to go around. Oh my, it looks wonderful. This is very kind of you. I really need to go around. You know what? We're not going to go to the mines today. We're going to talk with everybody. A word of warning. My husband really hates garlic. Just the thought of it can make him depressed. Oh, Caroline. Well, I know things about your husband and apparently you don't know. Whew, oh, that secret stash I found a while ago had to scrub my eyes. Sam makes a lot of noise with that music of his. I hope it doesn't disturb the neighbors. Um, I think Emily would love it, actually, because she loves dancing. That was so cute when we caught her dancing one day. That was awesome. Um, okay, so I think we're going to go up, and we are actually going to be putting this fried egg and the large milk over in the bundles, so we can just get that out of the way, know that that is completed. I'm going to give this fried egg to Gus as a gift. Let's come down and see what Vincent is up to. Unfortunately, I don't have anything cool to give him. Hey, Vincent. You're not as boring as most grown-ups. I'm glad, little guy. I wish I could do more for him. All right, let's see what Gus is up to. I think Emily is coming over to start her shift for the day. Oh, Sam, what you doing here? My dad's in the military fighting against the Gotoro Empire. That's why he's not here. Sam. Sam, dude, I wish I could... I mean, I gotta save those amethysts, but I wish I could give you more. He's coming back soon, though. Oh man, Sam, that tugs at my heartstrings. He really has like one of the saddest stories ever. Oh, Pam and Clint came into the come into the saloon almost every night. I'd probably go out of business if they stopped coming. So Pam and Clint, yeah? So make sure you don't drive them away. I never would, I never would. All right, let's give him the fried egg, see what he thinks. Oh, that's sweet, thank you. All right, so not the most excited about it, but it was worth a try at least, just because it's so fun to be able to share the gifts. I wonder if I should sell, can I sell my foods? Collectibles, cooking. Fried egg is worth 35. The roots platter, 100. Pell broth, 150. Algae soup, 100. Wow. That actually doesn't sell for as much as I was hoping. All right, anything in here? Nothing, darn. Anything in here? Nothing, darn. So yeah, I think, oh, there's Penny. Penny, I have a crocus. I have a crocus, Penny. Oh, hi, you wanna talk? I wonder if I, if you find anything, in, any interesting artifacts or minerals, Gunther would gladly display them in the museum. I feel like I may have disappointed Penny because I ended up dating Abigail instead, you know? He told me he has special gifts for people who donate. I have a crocus. Thank you. This looks special. Look, and Pam's hanging out with some worms. Oh, yeah. Let's go say hi to Pam. So apparently Pam really loves, um, oh, what was it? It was something like parsnips? It's awful cold. A visit to the saloon should warm me up, don't you think? <laughs> Why don't you swing by the saloon later for a taste of OB Joyful? I wonder, I wonder if I can get anything from the saloon. I think I can buy things from the saloon. Darn, those worms weren't guiding us to anything in particular. There's Maru. You know what? Let's actually see. Oh, there's a quest. 
Does anyone have an extra purple mushroom from Pam? I have never seen a purple mushroom. I'm not going to accept that and disappoint her because I have never seen a purple mushroom in the entire game. So I'm not even going to risk that. All right. And Carolyn's birthday is in a few days. Uh, she really likes the produce. So I might just grab like some produce for her. All right. There's Pierre. Hi. In the mood for a little shopping? Here's Elliot. Um, is Abigail home? I have an amethyst. <gasps> Abigail! Abigail, hey, there's David. Hey, David. Hi, Abigail. Uh, I still can't be the first level of Journey of the Prairie King. One day I will help you with that. All right. And for now, I'm going to give you an amethyst, though. There you go. I seriously love this. You're the best, Siri. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Hopefully one day we'll have more heart levels with her. Linus really loves us. Like, that's awesome. Um... I don't think I should give the bouquet to anybody else because that's, you know, that would be, that would definitely be playing. And I think that'd be really mean to do to Elliot. <sighs> I think Leia would just throw it back in my face. <laughs> I think Mario would ask if I had a fever. So the different people would definitely react differently. All right, let's go ahead and, oh, hey, there's Shane. Let's say hi to him too. Hey, Shane. You're really persistent. I guess I'm just surprised that anyone would be interested in talking to me. Oh, Shane. I wish I had something to give you, but I don't. I need more chickens. I, oh, we have a duck. We need to go see Cattail. How did I forget we have a duck? I already forgot we have a duck because there's just so much going on all the time. And yes, we will go and we will try. Let's see. So fried egg, large milk. Um, we will try to go gather up as much wood as we can because it's going to take me a little while to get that much money again. But we need to go gather up some wood so that I can try to build the next level of the... Um, barn so that's gonna be our goal so chef's bundle there we go there we go fried egg now I need to get the maki roll and fiddlehead ferns and let's go back to the other one. Oh, and I should go see if we can fish for some squid so let's try out our new iridium rod sands the tackle unfortunately and see if we can actually get some squid so here we go animal bundle large milk oh my gosh we just need a wool, a duck egg, or a large goat milk. We just need one of these things. And then we will, like, two of these things. And then we will be able to complete the animal bundle. And then all we need is to grow some quality parsnips and we'll have the greenhouse in spring. Oh, that's going to happen. That is going to happen. That is going to be so exciting and it is definitely going to happen. All right, so let's see. Um, Well, I guess we might as well go fishing and just see if we can get anything nifty other than squid. So let's ride on down. Oh, bye, Alex. Oh, have I not talked to you today? I wish I could control the weather. That would be pretty cool, Alex. Oh, I need more gifts for everybody. I really do. It's really hard to go from, like, the abundant crops of autumn and all of those corn pieces that everybody loves so much and then to have to suddenly just stand there empty-handed when there's so many people I want to give presents to. That's okay. Maybe if I go mining, I can get them all sorts of rare crystals instead. I love how Rose Stone's just going to take a nap now. Wow. All right. So it's just gently snowing. Let's see if we can get the squid, you guys. Oh, oh. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. Whatever this is, it's pretty wiggly. Okay, come on. Okay, it's not going to be a perfect catch, but come on. And I can put different kinds of tackle on. And what is this? It's a gold-starred albacore. So <laughs> I didn't know I could get this guy here. Do I? Yeah, yeah. I've got an albacore up in the corner there by the tide pools. Not at the end of the dock, I don't think. All right, let's try again. Come on, squid. We're looking for a squid for Willy. Oh, my gosh. This, this fish is just kind of like, no, I'm going to lay at the bottom, he says. Um, what is it? <gasps> a halibut! I think I needed that for a thing. I think I needed that for a thing. Um, ocean fish... No. River fish? No. Um, night fish? No. Never mind. I didn't need a halibut. <laughs> I needed tilapia. I think it got me excited because I got it mixed up with like the catfish and everything else. Well, let's keep going. We're looking for this squid. So far, the fishing rod feels kind of the same. I want to kind of put the treasure thing on it. So if we run into any treasure, I can make sure we get the treasure. All right. Stay there. Stay there, buddy. And what's this guy? A herring. Also not part of the bundles. Pretty darn sure. But I could turn him into... I could either sell him or I could turn him into some sashimi or maybe a maki roll. I just need to get my hands on some seaweed. 
All right, come on, buddy. Whatever you are, I've just about got you. And there's another albacore, record link of albacore. Wow, fishing for a squid is actually a little harder than I thought it would be. Oh, what do we get? <gasps> driftwood! I'm so excited because driftwood means things for Leia and it's actually really exciting to have all the recycling machines because even the trash we get has, yep, even the trash we get has a purpose. So I'm just gonna stand here and do a little bit more fishing and I will report back to you guys as soon as I figure out if we have gotten a squid or not. In fact, let's see if this is it. Whoa, hello there. Okay, no, 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 no. <gasps> Fooey. All right, well, I need to go get my treasure lure for sure, and I will report back to you guys as soon as I find a squid, or we've just had an interesting evening of fishing. So, holy days, what the heck are you? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Is this a squid? <gasps> it's a squid! We brought the squid! Yes! Oh my gosh! Boom, you guys, boom. They can only be caught in the winter at night and we have just caught ourselves a squid. Well, I might as well just spend the rest of my evening kind of doing some fishing and I will report back to you guys when I am done and we are back at home. So I'll see you guys then, bye-bye. All right, and here we go, you guys, wiggling back home at midnight. I actually rode past Shane, who was also coming home at midnight. Whoops, and I brought the I brought this soggy newspaper with me. At least we have a recycling bin up here. But yeah, I rode past Shane, who was also coming home at midnight, so that kind of cracked me up. And I think I'm going to keep one of these halibut, or let's keep this herring, just in case I can make it into something good for um, our recipes. And I think I'm going to keep the fire quartz, because I might need that in the future, too. Let's move some of these things around. And so we have a couple halibuts, we have a few albacore, and we have the squid that we are going to be turning in for the quest. But other than that, we didn't really catch too much. I kind of need to put some of our tackle, like our little lures that we have on to our fishing rod. So let's see which lures we have to pick from. And I need to add some lamps in my house. Oh my gosh. All right, let's see. So any lures in here? We have the cork bobber, which slightly increases the size of our fishing bar. I'm actually really grateful we have that one. That's pretty cool. And then we also have the dressed spinner. The metal tab and colorful streamers create an enticing, an enticing spectacle for fish. Increase the bite rate while fishing. So that's pretty useful because if we can get faster bites, then the time actually freezes while we are wrestling with the fish. So we don't have to worry about losing um, like losing our time and if we can just get faster bites but we also have the treasure hunter fish don't escape while collecting treasures and that's really cool and then you actually get a slight increase in the chance to find treasure and I'm really enticed by that one too so I don't know which one to pick first the fishing bar the treasure hunter the spinner maybe the spinner for now maybe the treasure hunter and I'm not sure how we take them off. Like once it's on there, is it stuck on there until it breaks? Hmm, questions, questions. And let's see if we can come over here. What did, what did the news say for tomorrow? Expect a few inches of snow tomorrow. And living on the off the land said, wondering how your hand on how to get your hands on refined quartz? Just put a regular old quartz in the furnace. You'll need a lump of coal to fuel the fire. Don't worry, we've already handled that, sir. Anything cool that we need to build? Um, I probably will move my seed makers inside actually because that would be really cool to have them in I don't really need to make any more preserves jars when I don't have anything to like put in them right now um, and we can make a trap bobber to Causes fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in that would be really useful and a spinner which will also increase the bite rate. So, hmm, there's lots of different bobbers that we're going to have to try out, you guys. That's going to be pretty fun. Um, and really, I kind of want to go to the mines, too, because I think the mines are going to be where the major money is. All right, and let's see. Mucky roll, mucky roll. What am I going to need for the mucky roll? Rice. So now we have fish, we have seaweed, and now we need to get some rice and we'll be able to complete the mucky roll. Not bad, not bad, if you ask me. Doing pretty good. Doing really good, actually. All right, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.